hello and welcome back to my channel Bosi Taros. Please guys don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Also please don't forget to go to my website located at www.boassytarots.com to get your reading from me. Also this reading is all alleged okay nothing mentioned here is a proven fact. Also nothing mentioned here is meant to disparage the party mentioned here or parties mentioned here. Also, everything mentioned from the beginning to the ending of the video is for entertainment purposes and not meant to harm yourself or to harm anyone else. Okay, guys, let's begin the reading. This reading is going to be for the young lady, Donna Lee, okay? This is a person of interest that was or is missing in Jamaica, the island of Jamaica. And I want to do a reading here for my tarot deck just to see or give me an insight into what happened to her or who or what did what to her, okay? As I stated before, nothing mentioned in this video is a proven fact. Also, tarot readings is not a hundred percent accurate okay this is just to give me an insight or show me or point me in the right direction or help to point me in the right direction okay the first card is um what happened to donna lee okay what happened to donna lee the first card here is the moon card this card is showing a lot of confusion um, it's showing me that she was confused or was in a confusing situation, okay? Not a situation that is clear. Someone here misled her, okay? The two dogs barking at the moon shows confusion or a secret, okay? A secret here has occurred between two parties, okay? Or three parties. Um, it's being alleged that her boyfriend has something to do with it or the person that her boyfriend is dating and the moon for Donna. So three parties are involved here and it's causing a lot of confusion between what has happened to her. As you could see, there's um, again, two dogs here barking at the moon and there's two pillars. Is it that God forbid um, she's no longer alive and she's hidden between two pillars or two um, a pathway or a tree or in um, some kind of wooded or bushed, bush, bushy area, okay? Uh, one second, guys. Let me just go for my next step. I want to get um, clarification here. Give me a second. So, yes, she is between two bushes or in a backyard. So, I would definitely search... Um, the boyfriend's yard or the girlfriend's yard just to um, see or you know if anything god forbid has happened to her and they try to get rid of her body this is where i would look so again some confusion is going on here with the moon card and um this to be honest even though i cannot go ahead of myself this does not look good um she has been miss missing for um some time now and she hasn't called her family or no one has heard from her so i would definitely try to see if i could look to see where she's located again the moon card is a card of confusion and secrets okay and most importantly deception some deception has taken place here okay some misunderstanding has taken place here okay and i would d um, definitely tell her friends or family members to follow their intuition there's some kind of illusion here okay that needs clarity okay so please listen to your intuition and there is some deception going on here and it needs to be there's an uncertainty people right now are uncertain of where she is okay so let me just do two more pulls from this card then i'm going to go to my family card here that is the blank deck um okay so where who is responsible for her disappearance please show the cards who is responsible for donna lee disappearance Let's see. Get the cards up. Okay, so who's the who's responsible here for her disappearance? Please show me. Four of Cups. Four of Cups is showing a male figure here. 
an offer was um, being handed to Donna that she was not um, quite paying attention to. Someone was trying to give her an offer. And also, as you could see here, this male figure is under the tree and there's a hand coming in. This could also show Donna and mean Donna. She was busy looking at three parties or she's in a third party situation herself allegedly her boyfriend and her boyfriend's girlfriend or mistress and she wasn't paying attention to a offer coming in is that offer a good one or a bad one okay maybe someone offered to help her out or offered to um god forbid give her a ride or she believed that she was being helped and she went with someone that was giving her the offer but with offers that are coming into you you have to look at who is handing you that offer okay as you can see here there's a hand coming in from the sky there's no one there so we don't know who this offer that came into her that gave her this offer so people be aware of offers that you are getting in not every good offer not every helping hand is a a hand that's coming in to help you is a helping hand this hand could mean or also be a hand that's coming in to sabotage you or coming in to cause a lot of chaos and confusion, okay? Again, the Four of Cups card is a card that is showing that someone here was feeling very disconnected. Someone here was feeling very melancholy, which is sad and down and indifferent to themselves, okay? When it's in reverse, this person is... Um, it's showing like clarity and you are aware of your surroundings are aware of what's being handed to you okay when it's in the upward position you're not aware of your surroundings and you're not aware you're not clear okay you, you don't have clarity okay you're most likely sad and depressed so it's showing that Donna allegedly was not paying attention to her surroundings or accepted the wrong offer from someone that she thought that was going to help her or that was like a helping hand to her okay and this is sad sometimes you trust people and you trust that they won't hurt you but the the people that is so close to you they're the ones most likely that could harm you so you have to pay attention to offers coming into you and who is why is this person offering like you always have to second guess people because people are strange nowadays and even before people are strange so you have to be aware the moon card is confused so maybe an offer that came into donna lee she wasn't expecting this person to harm her so this is why she's feeling or God forbid, allegedly, if she's no longer here and her spirit feels like they were um, taken advantage of or they didn't expect this person to harm them or harm her, okay? The third card from this deck is the following card. Who is responsible once again? Who helped in the situation? I'm feeling like someone helped. So this card came out. The devil card and the justice card popped out, okay? So the devil card is one of obsession. Someone here is feeling as if Donna was coming in on their relationship. There's a there's an unhealthy obsession here going on between three parties or two parties, okay? A male and a female. Someone here um, is, I'm seeing a male and a female that's involved in this and God forbid, or allegedly this is the boyfriend and the boyfriend's alleged girlfriend. Um, they're involved here because something came in between them, okay? And it's maybe or allegedly Donna that came in between their relationship and because they um a person here it could be one person that's operating that did it or both of them together they they conspire together see so there's a chain linking them together here with the devil card right there's a chain linking them together so they're linked in what um or bonded between what they both did to Donna okay both of them conspired to get rid of her um, because they maybe or allegedly felt that Donna was a thorn or a problem um, in between both of their relationship or one party felt like this and they felt as if they had to get rid of her because if they didn't it would always be an issue so yes again the devil card is showing that there's a 
there's an unhealthy obsession between these two parties, okay? Um, Donna also felt very powerless in the situation because there are two parties linked together to get rid of her. Like, she finally saw that one party that she couldn't stand conspired with another party to get rid of her or to harm her, okay? So once again, the devil card is a card that is showing that someone here feels... An, an unhealthy obsession for a next party and someone here felt very powerless so someone here is obsessed with someone and someone here felt powerless so could it be that the person that felt powerless was Donna and the person that has the unhealthy um, obsession with another party here is between the boyfriend and his girlfriend allegedly okay once again this is all alleged and not a proven fact and not meant to disparage the parties being discussed in this reading the fourth card is the justice card and the justice card is a card that is showing that there is going to be um truth coming forward soon okay someone is going to get a guilty conscience and confess to what they have done and karma is going to be visiting them soon okay they're going to have to be accountable for what they did as it pertains to what happened or allegedly happened to donna lee and this is the karma that you get when when you do mean and horrible cruel things to people and harm them and it's not justified you're going to get your karma and you, you have to be okay with that so the fifth card is the following card as it pertains to Donna Lee, where is she right now? Where is she? Is she still in physical form or has she passed on to the realm of the ancestors? So the Emperor card. Emperor card is showing dominance. It's showing that um, she could be well, like either, I don't know if she's unconscious or is it that um, someone has completely, a male figure has completely eliminated her, okay? Once again, this is not a proven fact, and I'm trying to still um, read to pull to see where she is, but I'm limited in what I could do and what I could see and read as it pertains to the card. But it's showing me that someone of a male figure that is dominant, the male figure is showing dominance here. They are the one that is responsible for this, and I'm seeing that since this is a male figure and he is technically stronger, in a sense, males are stronger than women, that it could mean that he complete her his energy is showing that he got rid of her okay allegedly so the sixth and final card for this deck i'm going to still pull from another deck that's beside me three cards um ooh, this card came out wow the sixth card and final card in this reading is the seven of cups why this was done to donna was because that they this person still wanted to have many options okay many options they didn't want to be tied down to one person necessarily and donna was the type of woman or young lady that wanted monogamy they she wanted to make sure that she was the only choice not a choice of many but the only one okay and this person here could not stand that so or this these two here conspire together to say okay they no longer want her in the picture and they want to this female figure here wants to accept and go along with what the male figure is saying that they want many options and donna was the woman or kind of lady that did not want that so they got rid of her but the scales again are going to be balanced justice is going to be served and done in the situation what you do in the dark does come to the light okay so let me move these cards here. This is the ending of this card reading for Donna Lee. I just want to go further into her, um, try to pull more to see what's going on. This is a family card deck, okay? What does her fam what's going on with her family? Is it that um, we have it wrong and a family member is um, responsible for her going missing and why? You know, God forbid, I'm not um, starting any rumors here, but I do have to ask these questions. Sometimes we are looking in the wrong direction and accusing the wrong person, and then it turns out to be a whole different kind of ball game that than what it is, okay? So, could it be that Donna's family, God forbid, 
had something to do with this and why. Or someone else in her boyfriend's family allegedly had something to do with it and why. So the first card is you need to leave for your growth. So Donna was looking for growth. She wanted growth, okay? She wanted, as the card was saying, with the Seven of Cups, she did. She no longer wanted to be an option. She wanted to be the main person. And this is what someone here did not want, okay? Regardless if it's coming from the boyfriend's side or her family side, and I'm, again, not putting anything on her family, but I have to look at all sides, okay? Someone she wanted growth and someone here that despised Donnelly did not want her to leave and did not want her to grow and because she wanted to leave or they felt like um, she didn't want to be an option anymore and they wanted her to keep her as an option, they got rid of her. So the second card is for Donnelly. Who is the one responsible for her coming up missing? Show me who is responsible for her coming up missing. Pay attention to your food. Do not eat. Do not eat from anyone. Okay. Mm -hmm. So sh could it be that they put something in her food or gave her something to eat where she became um, incapacitated, where she didn't know where she was, or just give her something where it knocked her out. So she. It could very well mean allegedly that they put something in her food okay where she could not focus was um, incoherent or gave her something to drink and she trusted the person because this is someone that she's used to and this is where how they could get to um, God forbid harm her or whatever um, transpired from giving her food to you know get rid of her they gave her something to eat i'm being seen or shown that they gave her something to eat and this is how they could overpower her to get to handle her okay um the third and final card in this card show me who is responsible show me and point me to who is responsible for donna lee and why um what did they do to her what is going on with donna lee right now what is the outcome that we should look? Where is the direction that we should look into about her going missing? That card is, your father is sabotaging your life. Wow. So it's showing that a father figure doesn't necessarily have to be Donnelly's father, but a father figure or someone in Donnelly's family or her boyfriend's family is or sabotage her life, okay? Again, this is not meant to start any rumors or to um, disparage Donnelly's father or her family members or whoever, okay? But a father figure, this does not have to be her father, but someone that she knows very well that could very well have been her father, okay? Or father figure like a brother, older person that she knows sabotage her life, okay? So this concludes the reading for Donna Lee. I do wish that she does come home safe and alive and well. And um, uh, people that's watching the video, if you are her family and friends, this is not meant to disparage her character or your character. This is just a reading for me, a terror reader, to give my insight from reading the cards, okay? Once again, disclaimer, this reading is not a proven fact, okay? And it's for entertainment purposes, even though it is a serious matter, I have to say that for legal reasons, okay? This reading is not 100% correct, okay? So take what you can from it and apply to this situation. Once again, this reading was not meant to disparage Donna Lee and her family and anyone associated with her, okay? This reading is all alleged from beginning to the ending. Guys, please um, leave down, down below in the comments what you thought about this reading. And also, please continue to send her family and friends prayers for her to come home safely. Thanks for watching my video and please guys do have a wonderful day. Bye for now.